Hey guys, what's up? This is another boy 16, and sorry about the really bad video quality. It is because my brother stole my other camera, so I don't have a camera right now, but I'm using a computer to do a re my um, video today. And what today is going to be a review on is a new camera that I got, which is a Canon, oh, yeah. Canon PowerShot. ELPH 160. Sorry about the reversal thing on the computer. I don't know why it does that, but whatever. It's just a piece of junk. Um, so, I have not opened this yet. I just got it in the mail today, actually about five minutes ago. So, I'm going to actually open it up in front of you guys and see what it looks like. And the reason I ordered this is because my other one, my black one, my brother stole that one and sold it to one of his friends. For something I have no idea what, but he stole it from me and sold it to one of his friends. And now I don't have a camera. And he also took my um, flip video camera, which I can understand some of um, some of you guys like you saying that that was a piece of crap anyway. It kind of was, but still I used it and he stole it. So he's an idiot and I hate him. So right, right now I don't have a good ca I didn't have a good camera to do this video on, but now I have this. So, we'll open it up and I'll show you what's inside. So, first off, the box is very nice, as all Canon boxes are. Open it up, you get your literature page, along with, um, along with this, uh, I'm not really sure what this is. Ah! Um, warranty card. You have a warranty card here, so keep that, even though I might not even need it, because I don't break my crap like most people do, <laughs> like some people do. But, um, and then you have your literature, which I highly recommend everyone reads. Which you know, this is just a promotion thing, I think. I actually don't know what this is. It might be their other products, like their printers and uh, apps and stuff like that. But it most likely is the manual, which I'm going to read because I'm one of those freaks that likes to read the manuals. And the teeny little tiny battery that goes in it. Which, if I had my other one, the battery from it would fit in this camera, but I don't think... You know, honestly, this battery looks like it's smaller than that one. Yeah, it is smaller. That's hilarious, but oh well. Smaller little 3.6 volt lithium-ion uh, 650 milliamp hour battery. Tiny as heck. These don't... <laughs> these don't really... If you know what you're doing, you can get these to last about an hour or so, but more than you won't get more than an hour of life out of these just because they're so small. But not dissing Canon for this. I love the t tiny little batteries. They're adorable, and they work pretty well. And they charge quickly, which is nice. Then the cardboard divider, no one wants to see that. Then you have your charger, which I think is the same that they use on all their Canon L... Yeah, Canon Power Shot series. This little teeny little battery just fits right on into there. I think I have one of these chargers already lying around, so I'll use that one. I guess. See, if, but I'm, I'm wondering just to do a comparison, just to see if this is any different. Actually, I can go get the charger right now and actually show you. Well, you guys can admire my underneath my bed lights, which I installed over the past few months. All right, so it does look like they use the same exact the, the Canon uh, series cameras. Whoops, sorry. They, it does look like the uh, cameras do use similar, if not exactly the same chargers. God, this camera's so terrible on my computer. I'm so sorry about this crap video, but um. Actually, I have my light here. So this is the old one that I have from my um, older, from my black one that I had. You can tell it's pretty beat up, pretty used. And then this is the new one, which is exactly the same. So, got the charger, got the warranty card and all that stuff. Also get a little lanyard for the camera itself so you don't drop it while you're holding it. 
which I, I don't really ever use those, but I guess some people like them. And then here's the camera itself. Ooh, that's nice. Nice and glossy. It actually feels a lot lighter than my other camera did, which is funny or weird, but yeah. So it's a lot lighter, and this is the one with the 8x optical. My old one had a 5x optical, so put it down, take the battery out, and see if we have any charge. Battery door works the same way. And you have an SD card, can support up to 32 gigabytes, I think, or I'm not sure if these new models can handle the 64 gigs, but if you're, you're not going to be able to get more than 12 gigabytes of memory use out of this one battery, so if you have like multiple batteries, then that 64 gigabyte will come in handy, but who the heck is going to be using a camera for three hours on end? <laughs> so, let's see which way this wants me to put it in. Okay, put that in. It's probably going to have me set the date and time, but let's turn it on. There it boots up. Yep, set the date and time. Ooh, I like the display. The display's nice. Hang on a second. I'll check my computer. June, which I think is the 4th. It's the fifth. Five dash four. Yeah, five dash four. Yeah, so this camera came out in 2014. 2016. Date and time. I wonder if this is military time. Yeah, it's military time, but it didn't really bother me. So let's see. 12, and 2, move my mouse so I can actually see the stinking thing. Daylight saving time's off. And then set to next. Time zone. So this actually came from London, this camera. It's surprising. Paris, Chicago, Moscow, do, 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 do. What in the world? Okay, that's weird. It's not letting me. Yeah, you know, I'll just set it to New York because that's the only one that makes any sense to me. I have no idea why it's saying that, but oh well. And then here we go. So the screen here. Oh my god, that's so bright, it's not even... <laughs> so, it says no memory card, obviously. And then it just has your auto and self-focus. And you can see it recognizes my face in the actual computer. By doing the actual thing, but... Oh sh my god, that's so bright, my camera cannot... Come on, computer camera, adjust, there we go. So you can see me. And then you can see it recognizes my face. So far, I like it. Pretty fast digital and pretty fast optical zoom, if you ask me. And that's pretty fast for a, for a camera this size. But anyway, I just wanted to do my um, unboxing and review of this camera. It does have a it does have the flash on it. It's a little bit different design than the um, other ones. It's, this one's a gloss. The other ones were matte finish. Doesn't really bother me that it is glossy. It's just gonna get it's gonna get dirty anyway because I'm gonna use it. But um, anyway, I just wanted to do my own video um, unboxing and review on this uh, Canon camera. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. 
I'll see you guys later. Stay cool, YouTube. Bye.